back. Uh, there you go, Ruby. Okay, cool. So let's get set. So let's back up real quick. Uh, you're just going to need your bodies for this. No dumbbells. Yet. All right, cool. So we're all back. Sorry about that. All right, so here we go. So we're going to back up. We're going to do our uh, Samson lunges. Okay, so we're going to interlock those fingers. Go to the back knee. Over to whichever side you stepped out with. That's one. Two. We're going to go all the way down. Guys are done. We're gonna do cow grazers, so we're gonna keep that weight on our back leg, front leg straight, toe point in the sky. Cut down, tap the toe. Next side, tip total. All right, cool. All right, guys. So uh, for the next one, what we're going to do, we're going to do some tempo squats. So we're going to all do this together. So I'm going to go like this. I'm going to count you guys down. We're going to go three, two, one. Pause at the bottom for three, two, one. And then we'll stand. We'll do that for five reps. Sound good? So everybody back up. Squat stance with your feet right outside of your hips. Toes pointed out just slightly. Everybody get ready. We're going to go down let's go down for three two one let's pause for three two one and stand get it let's go down again for three two one stand in three two one here we go down in three two one stand in three two one. Make sure you're keeping that weight on your heels. Extra drive your knees out right now. Down in three, two, one. Pause for three, two, one. I think that was four. Down for three, two, one. Pause for three, two, one. Everybody stay down. Everybody stay down. We're going to take those knees, drive them out, or elbows, drive them out against those knees. Now what I want you to do, put your hands on the ground. You're going to lean forward, drive those elbows out into your knees. Just kind of get into your groins a little bit. Stay down. Now what we're going to do is we're going to duck walk in place, okay? So we're just going to do 20 steps. Left and right is one. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. If you count like that, we're going to go all the way to 40. Left and right is one, all the way to 20. Cool. So it's right. Left is one, two, three. We're going all the way to 20. Just peek one foot up at a time.
Oh my God, it was very hard. Okay. So what I want you guys to do, find a wall, bed pose, something, one hand up, grab that right heel to pull it towards your right butt cheek. We're gonna hold. You guys are done, shake out. We'll switch. Keep holding. All right, and relax. Everybody stand at the back of their uh, towel or yoga mat. We're going to inch out, come up into that pigeon stretch. Keep moving. Switch. All right, and come on up. All right, guys. So, uh, for our strength piece, we're going to do five rounds of two different stations. Okay. So 10 total. And then we got a little finisher at the end. Um, I have a one minute rest written down in between these sets of these strength pieces, but we're just going to go, I go, you go. So however long that actually takes, it'll be around a minute though. Um, so the movements are, uh, it's going to be five and five single arm squat clean. So five with our right, then five with our left. The trick with this though, is that we're gonna pause for three seconds at the bottom of each one. Cool? So we'll do five on our right, pause for three seconds at the bottom of each one. Five on our left, pause at the bottom for three seconds of each one. Afterwards, we're gonna go right into 30 seconds of high knees, okay? So I'll kind of show you a few different reps here. I'm gonna grab my dumbbell, right? So I'm gonna be in my squat stance. We're just going to our hang position, so your feet are not gonna move. So we're gonna go down, up, pause, three, two, one. Three, two, one. I'm gonna do that for five reps on my right, five reps on my left, right into 30 seconds of high knees. Cool. If you got a light dumbbell, which I do, I'm gonna do weighted high knees, right? So I'm gonna hold this right up under my chin. I'm gonna go for 30 seconds for weighted high knees. So if you have a lighter object or a medicine ball or anything, you can use that. Wow, Ruby's got a cool deck. Uh, if not, no big deal. You're just gonna do 30 seconds normally, cool? So I'm gonna do the first round so you guys can watch. Then you guys will go, okay? I'm gonna get my timer set. Are there any questions, by the way? I saw, I saw everybody approaching their camera, but no one's asking. Should we be ready to start right now? Say it again. Should we be ready to start right now, immediately? Ready? No, you should. Uh, so I'm going to go first, and then you guys will go. So you'll, uh, you'll rest for like another minute. What would you consider to be a light dumbbell? Well, I'm using a 20, and that's a little uncomfortably head for me. So I would say that would be like your top weight. Great. Like 15, 10. Hi, Arthur. Okay, so I'm gonna do my first round. You guys are just hanging out. I'm gonna come through. Three, 
two, one, that's one. That's five. I lost track. I think that's four and five. All right, 30 seconds. Here we go. Oh, let's move. I can't see the clock. Ten more seconds. Everybody grab their dumbbell, get ready to go. All right, five and five, three second pause. You guys are up in three, two, one. Here we go. You guys are gonna be all starting and stopping at different times. If you have a phone or something, I would use your own clock. Knees up, Ruby. Up, up, up. Good. There you go, guys. All right, for the most part, you guys look done. I'm going to start my second. Ten seconds. All right. All right, guys, round two for you. Going in three, two, one. Here we go. Ruby, make sure you stand all the way up with that dumbbell before coming back down. So here, I want you to stand all the way up, then come down, good. Beautiful. You guys are done. You're going right into that 30 seconds of high knees.
States. Yeah, let's do that. Sure. Pasta and ground beef. All right. Round three. Ten seconds. All right, guys. Here we go in three, two, one. Here we go. Good, Cam, get all the way down the squats. There you go. Sink. Jason, try to bring that dumbbell between your legs like a kettlebell swing for the next round. To boil it. What? Come here. Oh yeah, good weight. Use that baby. Right guys, last round. Notice I'm trying to get my hips all the way below my knees. Ten seconds. Time. All right, guys, you're up. We're going three, two, one. Here we go. Better, Jason. Good, Taylor. Try to really sink down there. Drive your knees out as far as you can. You guys should almost be over exaggerating, exaggerating pressing those knees out.
Good job, Steven. Good job, Pete. Joshua, you're going to shake that baby's head off. <laughs> All right. Is that five or four? Four, one more. Y'all set? Ten seconds. And time. Last round, guys. Going in three, two, one. Here we go. Good job, Bill. Good job, Ken. Get those knees out. There you go. Light on your feet, guys. Light on your feet. Your neighbors downstairs should not be able to hear you. Oof. Job, Tina. Come on. Good girl. All right. All right, guys. Oh, here you're still going. Boom. All right, guys. So check it out. Next one, same format. It's going to be five sets. Um, for this one, we're going to do 20 half goblet squats. The thing with this is... Um, I just went heavy for the first one. So for this one, I'm going to go a little bit lighter as to go unbroken. If you don't have a lighter dumbbell, you only have a heavier one. I would just do half of the reps, like, or maybe not, you don't even have to do half, maybe just like 10 or 15. So you don't have to cut it all the way down. Um, so either 10 or 15, and then we're going to follow by 30 seconds of burpees, right? So I'm going to grab a dumbbell. I'm going to go right below and above parallel. So it's here. One, two, three for all the way for 20, uh, 20 reps. When I'm done, I'm going to my burpees for 30 seconds. Hinge down, kick those feet back nice and close. Roll to your chest, pop up wide, jump and clap, 30 seconds. Make sense? Cool. Five sets. I go, you go. 
Starting my clock. Here we go in three, two, one. Here we go. Twenty. Ten seconds. Three, two. One, you're up. 20, 15, or 10 half, half air squats or goblet squats followed by 30 seconds of burpees. Good, guys. Ruby, I'd almost say less range of motion. There you go, perfect. Guys, before you start the next round, I'm going to say something. So let me go first. Actually, I'm just going to talk about it while I go through my burpees. And I'll preface it here a little bit. A lot of you guys, like Matthew, I think it was Taylor too. Um, you're doing a lot of knee bending during your burpees. Okay. So when you guys are going down, it's almost as if you're squatting down into the position coming up and then landing in a squat. I want you guys to think about hinge. When you pop up feet wide, this is all you're bending. So I hinge down, straight legs, pop up, straight legs. I got 10 more seconds. Three, two, one. Boom, you're up. 20 and 30 seconds. Cam, next one, I want a little more range of motion. Yeah, there you go. Much better, Matthew. Save your legs a lot more, too. Come on, Peter. Pop up. There you go. Those are great, dude. All right, cool. I'm going to move on to round three. Another thing I want us to talk about, this will be during our half squats. Tina, I was watching you a little bit during this, so some of you guys as well, you'll come down. It's almost like you keep your shoulders there and you just go like this. Your hips and shoulders – I'll go up at the same rate. Keep those elbows off your knees.
All right, round three, guys, you're up. Much better, Tina. Good, Bill. Better range of motion, Cam. Matthew, those burpees look great. Go all the way down your chest. Give the people what they want, Bill. <laughs> All right, round four. Watch this fanciness. Ten seconds. Time. Heesh. Come on. All right, you guys are great now. Come on, Steven. Good old Steve's getting his workout in while Arthur's playing video games in the background. Bum. Right, last round. One. And you're up. Last round, guys.
There you go, Jason. Come on. Let's go, Wiener. Good girl. Um, okay, guys, I'm just going to jump right into the next piece. I kind of wrote this. Um, I was going to write 50 and 50, but I figured I would just put a time cap on it and just see how far you guys can get. If you get to 100 and 100, uh, that'd be great, but we'll just go for as long as we can. We have a little time, so maybe we'll go for actually 12 minutes. It's 100 dumbbell step-ups. It's 100 box jumps. If you don't have a box to jump on, you're going to do normal jump squats, okay? Um, you can break it up however you want, so 10 sets of 10, 5 sets of 20. Uh, with this, I'm okay with you doing this. Right? So for these step-ups, you're going to hold a dumbbell. I like to come up, right? Bring my foot down, but keep my foot up there. So if I go up and switch, I keep it up. Okay? And that'll give you a little more time to get all these reps in. Cool? Uh, for the next one, those box jumps, you're just going to jump up. And if my chair breaks, you'll have something funny, funny to look at on YouTube later. All right, so it's 100 dumbbell step ups, 100 box jumps. I'm going to give us all a 12 minute time cap to get through as much as we can. Are there any questions? Yeah. Break it so we, up. Got, we break it up like 10, 10 jumps and then 10 step ups are all just break it, go through one thing and then move to the next. No, you break it up however you want. So it's really up to you. If you want to do 100 step ups, then 100 box jumps, you can. If you want to do uh, 10, 10 step ups followed by box jumps. You can do that. It, you just, you just got to get through it. However you'd like. Thank you. Cool. All right, guys. Are the box jumps with weight too, with the dumbbell too? No, unweighted. I'm weighted, Peter. It's a rigid box. Huh? All right, guys, we're all set. And this is gonna be sketchy. We're gonna start in 10 seconds. 100 step ups, 100 box jumps, however you want. Going in three, two, one. Here we go. I did 25, now I'm gonna do 25 here. Two minutes in.
Yikes, pterodactyl. Four minutes. Six minutes. Good job, guys. Eight minutes, four minutes, four minutes left to go on the time cap.
you guys are getting tired, instead of resting, just switch to the next movement. The more transition time you have, the more time you'll have to rest, but you're still moving. Still moving forward. Good job, Tina, one at a time. Two and a half minutes to the time cap. Job, Tina. There you go, Peter. Step down, step up, one foot in front of the other. Two minute warning, guys, two minute warning. Nice, Cam. One at a time, keep that foot up there. Cam, land with your feet a little closer. Drive your knees out a little more. I don't want your knees to cave in. Better. Knees out, land knees out, land knees out. Boom, good. There you go, perfect. 75 seconds, guys. Thirty. Job, Yerum. Fifteen seconds. Come on, Tina and Peter, keep moving. All the way to the end. No one stop. Ten seconds. Done in five. Get one more in, Pete. Get up. Three, two, one. M time. Work, guys. I don't know about you, but my lower back is screaming. So let's start right on her back. Right knee up over that left side. Stretch it out. Switch. Guys, let's stay on that back. So we're gonna first grab that right kneecap, just pull it in as far as we can. Try to pull it to like the outside of your chest. All right, now let's interlock these fingers right under your, or I guess right up 
above, like pretty much on your hamstring, even though this is down, we're gonna go above your knee. Okay, point your toe down towards your chin, sit back, pull that leg in. You might feel it shake a little, that's okay. And let's switch. Pull that left knee into your chest. Eggs. Grab under that knee, toe down towards your chin, pull it in. All right, guys. Come on up to that left elbow, pull your right heel to your right butt cheek. Switch. Jeff, I have to go start another meeting. All Thanks. right, bro. Take care. Thanks for joining. You did good. You did well. All right, guys. How we doing? We alive? I'm gonna be real quick. Hey, um, as always, I hope you enjoyed your weekend. Thanks for coming out. And I, uh, as far as dumbbell goes, we have uh, 10, 10 builds or ten dumbbell tomorrow, and then uh, five butts and guts with Arthur. And then I will see you guys back on Thursday. Cool. Thanks. Later, guys. Bye. Bye, guys. Thanks a lot. Have a good night.